Welcome to this beam modeling demonstration using Autodesk Nastran InCAD in Inventor. Beam models, or 1D line elements, allow an engineer to represent a long, slender component with a very small number of elements in situations where hundreds or thousands of solid elements might be required. During this video, we'll discuss the speed and improved accuracy of using beam modeling capabilities on a tower model showing how cross-section or geometry optimization is easily accessible for all engineers. Instead of the solid elements that are normally used, we will mesh the model with line elements chosen here in the property dialog. Line elements require more properties to describe than solid elements and include things like cross-sections area, moments of inertia, shear factors, and other normal beam section properties. Alternately, Autodesk Nastran InCAD has the ability to define beam cross-section by its dimensions. There are a number of beam cross-sections included in a library available within Autodesk Nastran InCAD. Such shapes as channels, I-beams, T-beams, and box beams. To use this section, you simply enter the dimensions of your section beams as defined in the dialog box. You can click down here and it'll show you what your beam section would look like. Once you've made your properties, you can assign them to different parts of the model so that when it's meshed, different areas will also have different beam sections. This particular model has three different properties. One each for the diagonals, the horizontals, and the verticals. Once you have constrained and loaded the model, you can run it. However, before you run the analysis, Autodesk Nastran InCAD provides the ability to visualize the cross sections displayed on the model, so you can verify that you have the correct orientation and section defined for each part. After you run the job, most of the stress, deformation, and force results that are available from a normal solid model are also available for a beam model, although in different forms. Items such as axial and bending stresses can be plotted, as well as combined stresses such as von Mises and principal stresses. This particular plot shows an exaggerated deformed shape with the maximum combined bending and axial stresses plotted in color on the deformed shape. Because of the small model size for most beam models, they can be run multiple times, allowing for multiple designs and design modifications to be explored easily and quickly. Beam modeling using Autodesk Nastran InCAD enables designers and engineers the ability to create a smaller model that runs faster, resulting in increased ability to optimize your design.